Hamrus. Today I'm going to show you how to crimp smooth ferrule on low pressure industrial hose using a manual crimper. For this purpose I prepared an industrial hose. It's an Aftrex hose with textile reinforcement. This hose is designed for fuel and cooling systems with working pressure of up to 145 psi. Smooth ferrule. I match the inner diameter of the ferrule to the outer diameter of the hose and fittings which unlike a standard hydraulic fittings does not have lock on hose tail. Every crimping machine comes with three die sets. I have already prepared the dies I'm going to crimp with. Changing or putting the dies in is really simple. Just unscrew the bolts, take the cover off and place the dies in with the pin facing upwards. Next, put the cover on, making sure that the hole in the cover is facing with the pin on the crimper. Then, tighten the bolts. Once the jaw are installed, place the holes in the ferrule and push the fitting in. Now, position the holes so that the dies are in the center of the ferrule and start crimping. Crimping diameters are determined by trial and error depending on the hose used, because the force acting on the fittings at small diameters of hose assemblies is not very large. Follow the same procedure for the other end. The smooth ferrule system can also be used for quick release coupling, whether for water or air. We don't have to use rubber hose each time, it can be hose made of PVC for example. That's all for today, thanks for your attention, hope to see you again.